Fitra is that innate knowing that there's a God, that innate knowing of God. That's Fitra. Fitra. Fitra, 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 Fitra. Don't know how many times I just said Fitra. But it's been on my mind lately. And the reason being is because I've been thinking about why so many American Muslim converts leave the religion of Islam within a short amount of time. And I think one of the main reasons is because of the lack of focus on Fitra. And that lack of focus is from Muslims who are supposed to show that new American Muslim convert how to stay Muslim. And one of the ways is making them understand Fitra and focus on Fitra. But what happens is that many Islamic communities, and I split up the Islamic community because there's many different communities, but the majority of Islamic communities lack a focus on Fitra. Now, I've seen it, I've experienced it, and I know many Muslims will say, no, that's not true. Well, I know it's true, and you do too. We can't get away with brushing things under the rug and just ignoring it. So there is this lack of focus on Fitra. Now, Fitra, which I should have explained in the beginning, is that innate knowing that there's a God, that innate knowing of God. That's Fitra. And many American Muslim converts become Muslim and are interested in Islam because logically it's made sense to them. And sadly to say, that's where they stay, logically. They stay in their head. They stay in the land of thoughts. And the reason I know this is because I stayed there for a long time. And also I can see the talk among converts who are there. And I can see the push by born Muslims for them to explain why they converted. And it's always something like, well, Christianity didn't make sense. And born Muslims want to hear that. They want to hear, what? Islam's the best? Or, you know, the Trinity didn't make sense. So I looked into Islam and it made sense. That's fine. If that's what made you get into Islam, that's fine. But many converts stay there and they debate with Christians, especially if they were an ex-Christian. And even if they weren't an ex-Christian, they come from a culture in America that is based on Christianity. So they stay in the realm of thoughts, debating with the Christian. And what's actually happening is that they're debating against who they used to be, trying to justify why they are Muslim. They are defining themselves against who they used to be or against how they were raised whether they were a practicing Christian or not. They are debating against the norm. And they stay there. 
they stay in that realm. And what happens within a few years, that gets old. And when it gets old, the thoughts, which is where debate happens, gets old. And they don't want to debate anymore. And they have nothing keeping them Muslim. Because when those thoughts disappear, that anchor of fitra is not there. And I have experienced that myself. When I first became Muslim, for years, I debated against Christians. Now, I wasn't a Christian and then just became Muslim. I was a hardcore Christian and then for years was nothing agnostic so I still believed in God or the possibility of a God and then I became Muslim but I got into the debating and what I learned for me is that I was debating against myself trying to justify why I was a Muslim and then over time that got old and I still stayed in doing it I still debated because it was fun but I hate to say this, but you could be, you, you can only be a bully for so long. And after a while, I felt like a bully. I felt like I was attacking Christians and it was just too easy for me. And I'm not saying I was attacking intelligent, edu educational Christians. I can't even say educational. I was attacking Christians that didn't know their religion. So my point is, is that many converts come into this religion called Islam logically. And as Muslims, we don't keep them because we let them stay in their logic. And we give them this rule, that rule, this 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 rule. That's in the mind as well. And then they leave because they don't have that anchor of Fitra. So I'm about to go work out. So I just thought I would make my morning ramble my morning before workout ramble. So, peace and love.